What's going on gamers? Today we're going to talk about Apex's 1.16 quick start. Before we get into the tutorial gamers, make sure to like the video, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay up to date on all of Apex's videos. The new 1.16 Nether update brings so many different pieces of content to explore in Minecraft. This includes new mobs, new ores, and even new biomes. With so many new additions to the game, you may want to start a new survival world. Starting a new survival world can be exciting, but for some, the initial grind of gathering resources and setting up a base can be a bit… daunting. Luckily, here at Apex Hosting, we have an amazing 1.16 quick start server that you can use to skip past that initial base setup. In this guide, we will go over how to set up this version on your server, as well as discuss some of the awesome features that are included. The 1.16 quick start game mode will be selectable just like any other version on the panel. In just a few clicks, the world will be set up and ready to go. To get started, head over to your multi-craft panel and log in. In the jar files section, select the drop down and search the term quick start. Select the vanilla quick start version. Select change version and then use the included world. Restart the server and let it load. After this, you'll be able to join the server and start in the pre-made base to give you a head start. We have set this base up to give you the best head start on the new update. There's quite a lot to explore at your new base, but here are just a few of the quality of life features included in this pre-made world. The first thing you may notice is the large house next to you. This base was created with functionality in mind. It includes many useful rooms in all somewhat compact spaces, such as the enchanting room, the armory, the kitchen, and the bedroom. One very important feature is the pre-started strip mine. This mine will take you all the way down to Y level 11, which is perfect for finding all types of ores, especially diamonds. Managing hunger in Minecraft can be tricky at the start without the proper animal and crop farms. You will not have to worry about this in our vanilla quick start world, however. There is plenty of wheat, beetroots, and carrots to go around. Just be sure to replant them. We have also included a few animal pens. This includes cows, chickens, pigs, and even some horses. Arguably, the most important included feature would be the pre-made nether portal. This will allow you to go straight into the nether to explore all of the new content added to the game. You can trade with the piglins, find all new nether biomes, or look for the new bastion remnants to plunder. With so many new things to explore in 1.16, we hope this quick start world helps you to skip past all the boring starting points of the game and get you straight into the action. No more setting up farms or gathering initial resources, and you can either just decide to play it slow or jump right into the nether to explore. The choice is yours. I hope this quick start guide was helpful for you gamers, and as always, I hope you have lots of fun. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more great content like this, then subscribe or click these videos. Until next time, gamers.